Right, well that's me ready. I've got my pastels sharpened. Uh, I've got my grey, blacks and white pastels. I've got my pastel mat paper ready. Um, about ready to start. So the picture that I'm doing is this one. So I've mapped out the most important lines. What I'm going to do is take away the lines that I don't need, which is the grid that I put down. Um, so I'm going to take away those because it is a bit confusing at the moment. And um, the way I do that is I use blue tack, and that should. Should just lift off the pastel. It will leave some behind, but it won't. Um, it won't leave enough to show through the um, colours. So it'll just make it easier when I'm trying to blend uh, later on. So I just got to go across all these lines and get rid of all of them. Also, I've, I've made a few changes. Uh, from the actual photograph. Um, so what I've done is I've taken out the wheelbarrow completely because I'm figuring that uh, it will only improve the portrait not to have a wheelbarrow in there and uh, I've taken out this I think it's some it might be a horse blanket so I've taken that out as well because I want it be a bit dark around there so it makes it easier to see the child um, so yeah back to the blue tacking Okay, so I've put in a number of the base colours, um, so you can see the horse starting to come through now a little bit, these are just the base colours, I've got to put more layers on top of this, and um, I've got to do the child's hair as well, his face is pretty pale, so I'm just probably going to use white for that, maybe a few touches of grey just to Give some shading effects. Um, so it's starting to come along. Back to it, I guess. Right, so that's most of the background done. Um, so what I've got to do next is fill in this bit here and then start putting in more of the leaves and the reins uh, in. Got to start filling in uh, here and get this post sorted out. And then maybe a little bit more on the back ground get that all sorted out and then it's on to 
the detail work. Right, well I think we're, we're just about there. Um, what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to give it a look over and um, double check there's nothing that needs a bit of attention or anything that I've missed. Once I'm happy with it I'll put my signature on there. I'll, I'll put a photograph of the finished portrait at the end of this video. Yeah, it's been, been fun doing the black and white portrait. I haven't done one of those for a little while now. And uh, also I don't normally draw people either so that's been that's been fun and I've enjoyed doing this one it's just a lovely photograph so it's a, been a pleasure to work from so I hope you've in, enjoyed watching that and uh, if you have subscribe thanks for watching <laughs>